love at first sight experience of Romeo and Juliet? Is it a friendship that becomes more than just a friendship? In the next few clips, we'll see some true love here at Kennedy Collegiate. Miss, I came to you today because I know you're Nina's favorite teacher and I'm really worried about her. Um, I think we need to set up an intervention. I know. she. Uh, her spirit's out of control. She's she's literally bleeding blue and gold. Um, we have to do something. I got my grade 10s on board. They've written letters on to let her know how concerned they are about her. Hey, where are we going? Oh, Cory got you a blue and gold pony at uh, Doer's class. A blue and gold pony? It's awesome! Yeah. Let's go! All right. Nina, we need to talk. No, I'm out of here! Dennis, door. <laughs> Nina, you mean way too much to me. I love you too much for you to do this to yourself. You can't let this keep happening. I can't lose you. There's nothing wrong with me. This is ridiculous. Great tens, does anyone else have anything to say to Nina? Nina. Shut up! Ridiculous. You know what? I'm done with this. You're not blue and gold enough for me. I found someone else. <laughs> <laughs> we tried. I'm sorry. I know. I know. Hating on me for two years. Yeah, I thought it would be something else. I've never got jewelry before. What did you guys do last night? Well, I got home from work last night, and it was all dark, and he had orchids for me. And then he had Chinese all set up with a bunch of candles. And then at the end, when I opened my fortune cookie, it said, what you think wrong with me in the fortune cookie? That is so cute, James. You're so cute. Why can't you ever do anything nice like that for me? Hey, at least you got jewelry. I never get jewelry. It never does anything romantic for me anyway. Who was there beside well, us? That's the first thing. James, man, what was that all about? What? How you asked Sam to prom? Just is on my back now because I didn't ask for you. Yeah, Sam yelling at me because you bought your girlfriend a ring. Well, it's not my fault. What are you trying to do? I'm not trying to do anything. I'm trying to take my thunder. I did it first. It's whatever, man. Jess! Hey, look at the ring I found at my lost. It came oh with an God. anonymous note. But I know it's from James, trying to be cute. That is so pretty, but guess James, what? what? I went into my locker and I found this whole beautiful thing of flowers. Oh and it, it said, will you go to prom with me? And I think it's from Hayden, but once again, we don't know. But I think it was from him. That's so, so awesome. I'm so excited for us. I know. All right, let's go. I heard you bought Sam a ring. What? I heard you asked Jess to prom. Man, I don't even know what you're talking about. What do you mean? You're lying. You're, you're lying. lying. Come on, fight about let's this. Let's go. You blind! Roll up! Stop acting so childish! We're done! Okay? Forget this. Sam! Jack! Hey guys! Hi! I heard you guys are a single guy. Yeah. you like my ring that I got you? You, you got, got this ring. That I, to I love that it. Thank you. Yeah, you want to go to prom with me? Of course I'll go to prom with you. Yay! You're an idiot. Man, this sucks. You're an idiot. I'm not an idiot. You started. Man. You're so dumb. Do you want to fight? Do you want to lose again? Yeah. Let's go. I think that teenage love is naive and innocent and idealistic and false, but wonderful at the same time. I can't think of anything good. You have to give me time to prepare. Hayden, are you still filming? <laughs> what is teenage love? A waste of time. You should be studying. Mr. Pito, what are your thoughts on teenage love? Teenage love. No sex till marriage, no marriage till 29. Period. Why do people fall in love as teenagers? There's so much out there. You're all idiots. Thank you. I told you to get me a donut. 
Um, I think teenage love is just as emotionally real as adult love, but it's just statistically less likely to work out. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs>